Who is Squid Game's Oh Young Su? The one show pretty much everyone is talking about right now is Squid Game. No matter where you live, I am sure it's among the top 10 in your Netflix right now. It's a great show, it deserves the hype, but one main reason for this hype is definitely the incredible cast and their incredible performances. And I'm sure a lot of you will agree with this, the best character was definitely Player One or the old man played by Oh Young Soo. Yes, even though the finale revealed definitely made us hate him a little, well, a lot, but we have to admit his character is nothing less than absolutely amazing. So, who exactly is Oh Young Soo? Well, stay tuned in till the end of the video because we'll discuss everything there is to know about him today. But before we start, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. So without further ado, let's get right into it. For us, Oh Young Soo was a new face but for the fans of Korean entertainment, he is a pretty familiar actor. The actor is 77 years old right now and he's been in the acting business since 1967. So if you're a fan of K-dramas, I am sure you've probably seen him before. Anyway, he joined the National Theatre Company of Korea in 1987 and stayed there up until 2010. The 77-year-old has had a pretty great career in a lot of popular production from King Lear to The Tempest. Before Squid Game, his most recent work was on stage in 2017, when he starred as King Lear as the main character. Besides on-stage theater, Oh has also worked in many on-screen movies. One of his notable movies was released in 2003 named A Little Monk. The movie was about three different monks of three different ages and one of the main monk characters was played by Oh Young Soo himself. But that's not the only movie where he plays a monk. In the same year, Oh worked on his last big screen movie Spring, Summer, Fall, or Winter, and Spring. This movie was released in the States by Sony Pictures. The movie focused on telling the story of a Buddhist monk at different stages of his life. And Oh played the role of the monk in the old stage of his life. Before Squid Game, Oh Young Soo was mostly just known for playing roles of Buddhist monks in many different K-dramas and movies. Besides A Little Monk and Spring, Summer, Fall, Winter and Spring, he also played the role of a monk in Queen Seong Deok back in 2009. This historical K-drama was one of the top 10 most watched drama of all time and it generated around $50 million. Later on in 2010, Oh also played the role of a monk in The Return of Il Ji Mei. Again, in 2012, he played a monk in God of War. But even after all these roles, Oh Young Soo didn't have worldwide stardom. Well, Squid Game definitely changed that. The series gave its cast a worldwide popularity that none of them could have ever expected. Squid Game was a turning point in Oh's career as well. It's his most critically acclaimed drama, and if you watch till the end, you'll realize he's pretty much the main character of the series. Well, it took a whole lot of effort but at the age of 77, Oh Young Soo has managed to get so famous around the world and it's all thanks to Squid Game. I mean, that old guy was always known as a monk in Korea is now known as one of the best actors all around the world. So that's all there is to know about Oh Young Soo and his career. With that, we'll end today's video. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Also, 
press the bell icon so you never miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you guys next time. Till then, peace out and have a great day.